You know what? I think I totally misread you. I think I got something that you might like here. Hold okay. on. Let me find it. Oh, yeah. It's this one right here. Nice. There you go. Marlon Mack. Averaging more fantasy points than Devontae Freeman over the last four weeks. And listen, we wouldn't be caught dead carrying Devontae Freemans around here. You know what I'm saying? He also has more, 6.2 more fantasy points over the last four games than Frank Gore. And that's on 23 fewer touches. I mean, pretty soon this kid is going to become a household name. Not the return of the Mac, but the breakout of the dude, Mac. Dude, you feel oh, me? I'm feeling yeah, you so good, yeah, buddy. Dude, I got one more for you. This one's a super deep cut. Oh. You know why? No one was talking about this guy last week until Jay Ajayi got traded. Damian Williams. Yeah, Kenyon Drake, he's the hot name. But Damian Williams already had a role in Miami this season. He's outsnapped Drake 79-45, to and he has eight receptions for 50 yards this season. Following three straight years with over 20 receptions, Daniel, this dude is the real deal. He went to Oklahoma. Some people call that RBU, Damian Williams of Week 9. Dude, I like where your head is at. All right, I got one last one for you. Let me. This one's super deep. All right, here it is. There we go. Whoa. What do you think about this guy? Yeah, you're telling me. Absolutely. Rod Smith. I mean, dude had eight carries for 61 yards in Week 7, including ripping off a 45-yarder in that game. I mean, don't get me wrong. He's buried a little bit behind Darren McFadden, a little bit behind Alfred Morris, but this is the kind of guy that a Zeke manager could totally take a flyer on. And if he gets hot, man, the team might just roll with him. I was going to say, no one's talking about Rod Smith. Right? Brother of Jalen Smith, too. I'm sure these guys are looking to do their part on either side of the ball. Linebacker, running back, duo, they're kind of like us. I like Dynamic. it. Dynamic.